Hello everyone. Welcome back to our new video. In this video we will introduce you amazing beautiful place nearby Bangkok. That's called Dubua Cafe. Let me tell you how to get there. Duba Cafe around 50 kilometers from Bangkok. It will take more than one hour via driving car. The Duba Cafe that has a lots of things to discover. Suitable for bringing the family to travel, bring friends to ride bicycle. Also you can bring your girlfriend or boyfriend to kick the duck boat beside Lotus Pond. Best time to visit early morning or evening around 3 to avoid harsh sun and large crowds. Even though they have large cars parking area but during weekends or holidays too much crowded. It's considered another top place that is suitable to create a lot of memories. This place no need to pay for entrance or parking, it's totally free of cost. Something I will explain you later. This is a rural farm area in Nakhon Pathum, Thailand. Known for its numerous village farms park with different types of cafe. It's open Tuesday to Friday from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Saturday and Sunday from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. Closed on Monday. You can ride free bicycle, paddle boat and mini zoo including horse, parrot, puppy, fish, rabbit, peacock and deer etc. At the entrance point you can find bicycle. It is recommended to ride a free bicycle to see the atmosphere around the farm. Today weather is very good and sunny. In addition to the cafe, there are also shops, restaurants, agricultural farms, small markets, animal farm zone that is free for entrance. There are places to sit and chill including a lot of spots for taking beautiful pictures as well. In addition, the outside area also has facilities for all ages. Both wheelchairs and strollers are perfect for bringing families to travel around. In the cafe around Dubua, there also have a place named Cad Ben Kwai for everyone to walk. It is a market where people in the community will sell things to help generate income for this farm. If you want to take a free pedal boat to enjoy the nature around ponds, you can find nearby entrance lake. But you have to make cute. Lots of people are waiting for that paddle board that why we want to visit around first. Don't want to waste our time. Instead of wasting time we should visit others place first. This Dubu Cafe has an area of more than 54 acre. Divided into Dubu Cafe, Farmhouse, Mini Zoo, Infant and Coffee and Croffle Studio by Muyu. Now we will explore that Mini Zoo. Let's go! Animal lovers can feed some goats. Nearby goat zone have money boxes in exchange for carrots. You have to pay 20 Thai bath for buying one packet carrot for goat. If you walk a little bit straight you can find deer zone, but visitors are not allowed to feed them or touch them. Besides deer you can see peacocks, the Indian peafowl, also known as the common peafowl, and blue peafowl is a peafowl species native to the Indian subcontinent. It has been introduced to many other countries. Male peafowl are referred to as peacocks, and female peafowl are referred to as peahens, although both are often referred to colloquially as a peacock. If you walk beside pond nearby cafe you can find Second World War small museum and clothing store. Just in front of that store have bending machine buying food for rabbits. But lots of people waiting on that queue. Also have money box that you can pay 20 Thai bath and take one packet carrot for rabbit. This rabbit zone also known as bunnies or bunny rabbit zone. Includes the European rabbit species and 13 wild rabbit species. Among them the 7 types of cottontail. Rabbits familiar throughout the world as a wild prey animal, as a domesticated form of livestock and pet.
nearby by the cafe you can find fish. In the lake also you can feed them. For feeding fish also you need to buy prepared food that only 20 Thai bath. If you're puppies lovers you should visit Dubua Cafe, but it's only pilot's project that visitors can enjoy more. Different types of puppies and dogs you can find in one place, including Bulldog, Pomeranian, Cairn Terrier and Dachshund etc. Which one is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. After walking around if you feel hungry you can find food outside cafe also. Outside cafe also have lot of drinks, snacks and souvenirs. Bang Crispy Break is another souvenir that tourists must buy take to the home. Importantly buy one, get one free. My recommendation garlic and butter flavors. Outside area also has facilities for all ages. You can having your food under the tree but during weekends very difficult to find empty tables. Our next destination is Buffalo and Horse Farm. You can buy soft green grass only 20 Thai bath. Also there have box that you can drop your money inside that box if doesn't have any staff around. Before leaving, I would like to stop by to eat ice cream to get rid of the heat at Tim Ka Ti. Homemade ice cream with soft buffalo milk sticky rice, the signature of the shop that I would like to recommend very much. You can put your money in that red color box and pick up carrots or green grass for penny or horse. This is Island Cafe. Don't be confused. It's additional zone 2 and 4 having drinks and snacks. There is also a lotus flower wooden bridge to walk as well. The sun is strong. Unfortunately doesn't have lotus flowers. We want to visit next time because we want to take lotus flower pictures. Take very beautiful photos. It is divided into indoor activities and outdoor activities. The atmosphere inside loft style is comfortable. The menu has both coffee, tea, juice and bakery. Outside you can walk in the middle of the lotus flower island and take paddle boat traveling around. You can't miss peach tea, megano, kumquat and strawberries, fruity yogurt type ice cream, as well as a variety of macarons, including Thai tea, roses, coconut, iced milk, passion fruit and green tea. Especially we choose mango and blueberries flavor. This two item was 118 Thai bath. In this Dubois cafe have lots of places for swinging. You can sit under the tree or beside the lakes. Different view different feelings. Nearby have raccoon and meerkats, but all of them was very tired. They're sleeping like never sleeps since long time. It is characterized by a broad head, large eyes, a pointed snout, long legs, a thin tapering tail and a brindled coat pattern. You are not allowed to feed them or disturb them. On the way back to entrance, you can find cases full of parrots and cacatua. At the zoo, they eat a commercial food, nuts, seeds, fruits and vegetables. Parrots thrive on attention from their human flock and it is vital to their emotional well-being. Being locked up and abandoned in a cage to spend days inside cases does not make for a very agile life. Even Kakachua was looks very sick. They don't want to open their eyes. That was pathetic to watch them inside. I must say, Cafe Dubua is not just famous for lotus flowers but also there have lot of activities to do, including cycling, duck paddle boats, visiting the mini zoo. If you run out of COVID, 
don't forget to visit. Guaranteed to get a smile and fun back for sure. Please let us know if you had any experience of visiting Thailand or where you want to visit in Bangkok. Let's let other people know your experience about world's most famous places. If you like our videos don't forget to like or share. Also you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Remember try to be safe yourself and always smile. We got to go now. See you in our next video. Thanks for staying with us.